Okay, so you've written your perfect day. Hopefully that's going to be um, energizing and that vision is going to inspire you. We're gonna take it back a little bit and you know, we, we alluded to this idea before about the motivational systems of pain and pleasure. And this journal, if nothing changes, is embedded in that idea of who we might become if we don't actualize these, these kind of tasks to become who we want to be. Again, this is another confronting journal, but it is my hope that you will look upon it, um, you know, through a motivational lens, you know, to, to, to um, put a positive spin on it. So when you're thinking about if nothing changes, you essentially want to ask yourself, if I keep living by this myth, okay, the myth that you wrote, who am I going to be in one, two, three years, for example? You have a specific time frame in the journal. And it is confronting because we don't want to be, especially if we're doing this course, we don't want to continue to live in the way we are. I personally believe that we should all be focusing our attention on life in uh, you know, fulfilling our potential, always trying to self-transcend, self-actualize ourselves, because we can always do more and be more. Now, there's a really cool debate out there, and on one side of the fence, people are saying that we should love who we are, and I believe that. And on the other side of the fence, there are people saying that, you know, akin to this kind of idea, we should always be doing more, improving, we're not all that we could be, as an example. I think you can merge the two, and you can love who you're becoming. If you are doing the work, if you're putting in the time, you're completing tasks that fulfill you, you are self-actualizing, you can stay in the present whilst having a keen eye on the future. So if you love who you are becoming, you know, going back to the welcome part of this, of this course, we can have a filled life. You know, we are always in that state of progress. Life does become a fun journey because we are always moving to a better place, you know, and even who we are today, as an example, you know, compared to who we were yesterday, we are happier with who we are today because we put in the work that fulfills us. So when you're having a think about this journal, you're having a think about if nothing changes, if you don't do anything, how much more painful and how much worse will you feel if you don't do that work? And again, it's motivative. This is intentional. This is not just we're not just saying, oh, bad you, bad you. It's like, hey, you can actually do more and you have the skills. So, you know, really use that idea. Um, you know, the fear should um, excite you. Should, the fear should, you know, get you that idea that you're, you've always got your back to the wall, but that you can move beyond it and, um, and live that perfect day that you absolutely deserve. So please enjoy the writing.